Hey YouTube, iPhone for Idiots here, and I uh, wanted to do a quick video. First 24 hours since I jailbroke my iPad to show you some of the things I've been installing from Cydia on there. Um, maybe get some suggestions for you for some other stuff I should add. A uh, million people, or a million downloads have happened from uh, jailbreakme.com, so the uh, vast majority of those I'm sure were iPad 2. So um, anyway, without further ado, let's look at some of the things I've added. Okay, this is Barrel. This one um, costs two ninety nine. It's the only one that uh, costs any money that I'm showing you. But it has these all these cool effects. Like that's called Pac Man. It's in your settings. There's about twenty effects. Um, I'm gonna switch uh, here for, to uh, Flippy, which kind of makes it turn like the pages in a book. Um, so it, it's pretty nice. Um, it's just kind of fun. It makes it feel like a new device because you got you know it doing so many different things. Um, next here. Um, I'm going to take a look at Folder Enhancer. This one's really great. Um, you can basically put as many icons as you want in a folder, and because they have pages, you can just turn. But um, more so than that, it has folders within a folder. So you could say label if you're a realtor, label a folder listings, and then have folders for each address of, that you have with the photos and all the documents you need for each one of those within that folder. So that's really nice. And it also gives it just kind of a, a better folder look. I Installs SPS settings, which you see that just drop down here. Um, it's got all your toggles for your important things: 3G, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, etc. It's kind of a must-add. So another cool free thing I added to the iPad 2 is, of course, multi-touch gestures. Of which there are three basic ones. With there's the four-finger slide-in to switch between uh, apps. And this will work left or right. Um, there is the pinch to close, which we'll show you here. Um, and then there is the four finger slide up to display the multitasking bar. Um, so basically, you don't really need to hit your home button anymore to do stuff like this. And one day, I think Apple will go to all of this and get rid of the home button to open up more display. But anyway, to um, so to get this, all you have to do is uh, install three things: uh, Winterboard. Um, once you have Winterboard, then you want to install MT Gestures theme. And then lastly, um, there's one called MT Gestures, and I'm sorry, Enable MT Gestures up here at the top of Winterboard. And then after you do that, you just need to open Winterboard, make sure that that's checked, make sure your d device is checked, iPad 2 for me, and then Enable MT Gestures. And then you're pretty much good to go, although you might want to check um, Winterboard in settings as well if it doesn't work. But that's all you need to install, and uh, it will work. Okay, this is called RetinaPad. Um, you know how a lot of the apps have one times, two times, and go small to big on your iPad. RetinaPad makes the bigger, um, it doesn't look pixelated anymore. It makes it look a lot crisp, crisper, sharp. Um, it's very nice for uh, just having a cleaner look than the uh, pixelated um, when they blow up the iPhone size to the full iPad display. And if I didn't mention, other than Barrel, all these apps are free in Cydia. Now, this one's called Full Force. Um, most of the, uh, a lot of the apps are only for iPhones. So, you know, they just have that small size on an iPad, except you have the one-time, two-time buttons. You can kind of blow them up to look, fill up more of your screen, but then a lot of times they look pixelated. That's what Retina Pad is for. Um, but you can use Full Force to get rid of that one-time, two-time button and actually have them fill up the full force of the display and not you know, have the borders. Um, what you're seeing me here do is, uh, do here is you have to, after you enable it, you toggle it on and off in settings, you actually have to up, open up multitasking and close the app the first time before it takes effect. So that's what I was just doing right there. Now you can see how much uh, better it looks when it actually fills up the full, full display. Um, Facebook looks a lot better, so my wife will be happy. Okay, so there you have it. That's some of the stuff I've put on in the first 24 hours. I'm definitely going to add a lot more and you know, t tweak it, add a theme. But uh, let me know in the comments um, anything you think I should be adding to my iPad 2 now. Um, sorry if I talked a little fast, but uh, anything um, you don't understand, just uh, the, click the link and it'll take you to an article where it lists all the things I talked about. Um, 
And if you have any questions, just put them in the comments and I'll be happy to answer them. And uh, anyway, we'll uh, see you next time.